good morning guys i'm just up doing work right now but i just took a drink of my coffee and look i like sipped right here and it turned the froth into a heart good morning <laughs> all right here's a little update for y'all worked out this morning and now i am oh it's bright now i am about to make some breakfast and then we're getting on the road to go to pensacola jay and i are babysitting this weekend so my sister's in a wedding in pensacola so we are going to meet them there we have a house that we're staying with my brother-in-law and my sister and then obviously ty and we're gonna be babysitters for the weekend jay went to school in pensacola so it's kind of fun going back there anyways and yeah so it's thursday we're going to i think we have a seven hour car ride and we're gonna leave in probably an hour or so so just finishing up packing up just showered after getting a good workout in and now i'm in some comfy road trip clothes but i just wanted to start off this vlog and say hi guys here's my breakfast egg white scramble some avocado and then i'm gonna make a protein smoothie before we hit the road we are on the road chugging right along we've got four hours and 46 minutes left we're gonna get there around four o'clock or so just stopped and got a diet coke it's already gone i'm trying to decide i think that chick-fil-a holds the record of or holds the spot of being the best diet coke out there i forgot my olipop i had him sitting out and i meant to bring my olipop with me but stopped and got gas got up and walked a little bit around a gas station and then got some diet coke and now we're back on the road we also packed a cooler so i just got done eating some lunch i had cod some almonds some veggies and feeling really good gonna knock out some work it's just the passenger princess life over here what's up y'all <laughs> jay's snacking and we're listening to rod wave i think we've only listened to rod wave this entire time haven't we and mike and mike those are his two favorites for sure i've actually become they become my favorites too Jam, but look home Jam, morgan wallen i know i like Honestly, maybe I'm so weird for this. In Maverick City. Ma yeah, Maverick City and Red Rocks, and those are those are definitely who I would just put on. Like I would never even put on uh, Rod Wave or anything like that. But I will never, if I'm alone in a car, I will never turn on music. Dude, Sydney listens to Two Chains. I do not. Her I've been. Favorite rapper is Two Chains. I would not even be able to think of one Two Chains song. Right. I'm letting y'all in on a little secret. Wait, give me one two chain song and I'll see if I can sing it. If my dog buried me next to a bullet stone. I've never like I've never heard that. I've He actually did sing uh, or have me sing a little boozy song this morning and I remembered it. What was that? They think that I'm crazy. Yeah, but I'm not crazy and my mistakes don't make me. I'll say, or break I'll say me. babe, who's, who's that who sings that? Oh, People always quiz me on songs and every once in a while I think I surprise you a little bit don't I my sister was a big rap girly for a very long time so I think I know a lot of my rap songs she would jam them driving us to high school like very crazy I'm not my okay I'm gonna turn this off because we've got smack McGee over here Sunny's barbecue oh. yo Sunny's is so good yeah we made it to Pensacola We've been driving and Jay's like, I did this in college. I went here in college to get chicken wings. <laughs> like bringing it back because he did that last time too. And I learned so much. It's cool because like when we went to Tuscaloosa, I was able to kind of show him my stomping grounds. And then we were only here for a couple days last time, but we're back. Look at what I found. We're at Walmart right now getting some groceries and they have water drop. And I also have never tried this flavor or the peach ginger. I'm getting all three. We finally made it to our Airbnb. And guess who spilled something on their favorite new shirt? Yeah, the second we got here, he spilled. But we were smart because actually it was Jay's idea to go to the grocery store on the way in. We stopped at Walmart, got all of our groceries. I was like, just get me there. I just want to be out of this car. But I'm glad that we stocked up on everything. And also, they had water drop there, which I'm excited about. I brought my little glass water bottle and water drop are these little hydration cubes and they have different flavors. I've got all sorts of different flavors. I've told you guys about them before, but you just pop them in your water. I was complaining on the way here. I was like, I'm so bad at drinking my water when we're traveling. So this is gonna help so much but they're packed full of vitamins. There's zero sugar, which we love. 
and you can now get them at Walmart. And also, if you don't go to Walmart to get them, you can go online. You just let it dissolve in your water, just like that. And I love, I'm a beverage girl, through and through, let me tell you, and this is gonna help, and I'm gonna be on my game this weekend. Y'all count on it, okay? I'm gonna be on my game. <laughs> now let's get to cooking. We're gonna make some ground turkey, some broccoli, all the things for dinner tonight, and I am just so happy to be out of the dang car. Let me tell you. <laughs> this is like such a nice Airbnb. It's huge which works out so well, because we don't feel like we're on top of each other, but like both the rooms have huge bathrooms, big bedrooms, oh my gosh, it's so nice. With a nice little patio. Look at this closet, like could we just stay here for a while? <laughs> we're making some dinner right now. Look at this, y'all, there is so much space in here, and this is only the first floor, or this is only the second floor. Making some dinner right now, and then it's time to eat. I got these little salad things to put some ground turkey on. guys happy Friday so here's what's been up this morning woke up and I definitely am struggling with my allergies a little bit so we ran to a Walgreens got some allergy medicine so hopefully that helps me also forgot dry shampoo got some dry shampoo and got some lotion so clearly I thought I was like really successful with my packing and maybe forgot a couple things but that's all right we just got done at the YMCA uh, here in Pensacola so got a little workout in and now we're headed back to the Airbnb and we're gonna get coffee with my sister and my brother-in-law and just see where the day takes us so good morning and happy Friday casual Friday <laughs> Pick up the vlog. Say what's up to y'all. What's going on? We're here, Pensacola, Florida. Beautiful morning. Workout complete. Now we're just waiting. We go grab some coffee. Ty's upset. He's crying. Figured I'd grab the camera and say what's up. Sydney has no clue. All right, see y'all later. Peace. Here's my outfit for today. We're about to go run and get some coffee. I'm wearing this cute little aloe set. And I've never worn this before. I thought that it was gonna be like a little bit too hot because these are like fuzzy shorts underneath, but it's not at all. Isn't this so cute? I, the reason I haven't worn it yet is because I have to be so careful when I wear white stuff because I always have self tan or spray tan on. Ty's grumpy this morning. <laughs> Look who I'm back with. The vlog misses you. We would yeah. have slumber parties all the time. And now Shelby is MIA. So like, where's our girl at? Being a mom and whatnot? And whatnot. <laughs> Back at the Airbnb, got some coffee and now we're making some breakfast. Doing some egg whites, got some toast, had some watermelon. Here's breakfast. 
It's time for a little beach day we've got going on. It's actually pretty gloomy out right now, but we just plan on going and playing beach volleyball. I've got this little floral bikini on. I think it's by LPA is the brand. And then I have these shorts on, which these are my pajama shorts last night, but they match perfectly. And since we're playing volleyball, I can't stand when you're like constantly adjusting your bottom. So I think that this will be good just to wear while I'm playing beach volleyball. And I hope the sun comes out because I would love some sunshine. Had coffee, had my breakfast, packing lunch right now to bring out to the beach. And yeah, that's about it. Little update. <laughs> How we doing, Muffin? Hi. Are you ready for a beach day? Last night he was playing with my phone and uh, he took a bunch of pictures of himself. <laughs> He was sitting there going, ah, Oh my ah, gosh, that's funny. You like having a camera in your face? <laughs> you and your Uncle Jay are styling, man. Y'all, oh my gosh. If I, here's an update. <laughs> um, we're just back at the house and we're babysitting Ty tonight, which I don't know if I've even told you guys kind of why we're here. So we're in Pensacola because we're babysitting, I think I told you guys this. Yeah, we're babysitting my nephew tonight and tomorrow while they have wedding festivities. Today was basically get together with everyone um, in the wedding party and who was here for the wedding at the beach. But, um, so we were there and kind of like hung out with Ty in the car when he got overheated and hung out out while they played volleyball and everything. So that was really good. Um, but I feel like I'm having an allergy attack. I hope it's not a cold but I am feeling so stuffy and just hoping hoping that I'm not catching a cold. Every time I travel ever, I feel like I catch a cold, but I know that my allergies are what make my eyes burn so much, so I just think that that's what it is. We're gonna hope, but I'm gonna drink a lot of water and try and get a good night's sleep tonight because I have not slept well the last couple nights either. Anytime I'm about to travel and then also when I'm away from home, don't sleep the best, truly. So yeah, that's just a little update. I'm just in a comfy outfit and we're just chilling at the house for tonight. Good morning guys, happy Saturday. We're doing a little Starbs run. Morning. Yeah. And we went to that place yesterday and we're like, I think we like our Starbucks better. Yeah. It was really cute in there, but like you just cute. can't go wrong with Starbucks. Especially when you get nitro cold brew. Nitro cold yes. brew. You get some like nitro cream cold brew here or something? The sweet cream. Mm. Nitro sweet cream cold brew. Yeah, and I tried that so of yours one time or what was it that I tried that it was a new one? No. Oh, that was, was the, that? Shoot. That was a newer one though, but I like It was like a some kind better. of cold brew. Yeah. Cream. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So good. So good. But she's got wedding festivities starting at it's seven o'clock right now. It's starting at seven thirty. You've got a whole day ahead of you, girly girl. Yeah. So we're just getting everyone Starbucks. Clearly, my allergies are kicking my butt. I was like trying to think: is there like a, a doctor around here I can go get like an allergy shot or something? Oh, I I know. I know. No, I'm just yeah. like trying to like think of ways to clear it up because I this is how I used to sound literally all the time. You remember that? Like this, I like grew up sounding just like this. <laughs> Perpetually nasal. No, like the most nasal. <laughs> human in the world I'm like I'm having a little bit of flashbacks because I thought I got away from this but I think that's growing up in a house full of dogs cat. then yeah cat I'm even more allergic to cats and then and then moving out having a year without a dog and then moving in with you having dogs again I sounded like this for a lot of years Welcome back. And I think the pollen's bad or something. Because you said your eyes are bad. My eyes you. are itchy here, yeah. I don't know what it is. It feels different here. Than, and then Josh said that too. From, but yeah, I don't know. Something in the Pensacola air. Yeah, we need to get back, get back to my clear air where I can breathe. <laughs> I was like, I better not be sick, but all of us feeling like that the second we got here then. Has to be. Has to be that. Okay, good morning, guys. I got, I'm trying this out. It's the Venti Ice Passion Tea with half green tea. So instead of water, they do green tea. And I'm sure it's so annoying listening to my voice right now. I'm well aware of that. Hopefully y'all can get past that because I'm so, so nasally. I was gonna get Zyrtec, but why the heck is Zyrtec so expensive? I'm like, I hope these are allergies. So I'm just gonna get like some generic name brand, but now I'm thinking I need to go back and get some like extra strength allergy meds. I'll shut up about my allergies now. Okay, I like this. It's not that much different. Yeah, it's not that much different, but 
just dropped off my sister and here's what we've got going on today we're gonna go to jay and i are gonna go to a workout class i can't remember what it's called it's called like fit something here and it is yesterday literally all i did was walk on the treadmill dang i just dropped my phone underneath my seat where is it i don't even see it like how oh there we go so it's only 7.30, our class is at 9, so we were like, oh, we'll just like walk around, and I didn't get coffee on purpose so that I could get some coffee while we're walking around, and it's kind of nice out, but it's actually kind of chilly, so I might change into some pants, but bringing home a grande vanilla cream cold brew for my brother-in-law, Jay didn't want anything, and then I obviously got this, dropped off my sister for all of her wedding festivities stuff today, and yeah i don't really know what else we've got going on today mostly just this workout class originally we were gonna go see my best friend Jeannie. which growing up is realizing that when people have kids and stuff it's so much harder to see your friends and obviously my sister and stuff she has a kid so it just makes things like one of our good friends uh lucas and amanda they have kids and we'd like love to see them but it's so much more into the equation when you have kids which we totally understand it's just part of like being at that age you know when you're like 18 to 21 everyone can kind of go anywhere anytime and see each other but uh Jeannie, brent and then they have all of their kids with them and they're in miramar right now and we're in pensacola so we were like we'll meet in the middle because we're babysitting ty so like we won't be able to be gone for long but we wanted to at least see them and it's just too much to like get all of the kids to the middle go to a public beach it's just it's just like not worth it honestly and it sucks because i went from seeing her every single day in tuscaloosa and now i've seen her like one time in the last year when we went back to tuscaloosa and it's just hard because it's like that's my best friend i want to see her more but it also is like so such a challenge because life happens and like when you grow up you have your job and you have kids and you have you know so many more different things that you have to do and that was like definitely a feeling of oh man this is how it happens like imagine when i have kids kids how it's more kids to work with like right now we're pretty flexible we'll be like okay we'll go wherever whenever make it work um but also we're here babysitting so that's kind of that's kind of that I think I said yesterday that we were going to see Jeannie and Brent today and I'm really upset that we're not going to but at the same time it is it is what it is and i'll make sure to make a trip to tuscaloosa or something soon to see them and see all of the kids so that's my best friend that i was their babysitter and that's how i became good friends with her because she had uh king and then rowan at that time so it was just the two of them and i was their babysitter during covid and then i spent so much time with them i got along so well with her so that's the update but gonna go back to the house and grab jay and we'll go walk around and whatnot Here's where I ended up doing my workout. I did Ride Society while Jay did a different workout class because I we rode by this. I'm like, this looks so cute. I want to try it and literally signed up two minutes before the class. And it was a 60 minute spin class, which was brutal. Another Sydney breakfast post-workout. I did peanut butter toast this morning, but I'm going to have another piece. I've got my peanut butter right here and some egg whites. Here's the outfit today. We're going up to lunch real quick. And I forgot I brought this because I had just gotten it not too long ago and have never worn it. And so I was going to let my sister wear it if she needed to wear a little pantsuit cute outfit. And she didn't end up wearing it. So I'm going to wear it today. Cute but comfy and so airy. And I'm going to use this little by far bag. I think that we're just going to go get some seafood on the water. I'm like really feeling some fish tacos or some salmon or something. Um, hopefully I can even taste it because you know when you're really congested and you can't taste hardly anything uh, It's kind of how I was when I was eating my eggs this morning And if you guys are like probably thinking can you shut up about your freaking cold or your allergies? <laughs> Anyways, we're headed out to lunch and here's my fit Hi muffin man Hi muffin man with a cute face Curious face is what that is I know you don't know what to think, huh? We're at a place called Jocko's. Starting off, look how good this looks. Salsa, chips, and some guac. 
Also, look at this view. Thank you, Lord. I got a crab cake salad. We are starving Marvin, but we're gonna dig in. Crab cake salad and a chicken salad. Happy boy today. <laughs> and this is how he normally is, honestly. We don't know what goo goo gaga means in baby, but he loves it. <laughs> a goo goo gaga. <laughs> All right, we're about to head out for dinner tonight. It's just me, Jay, and Ty. And we're so excited. We're so excited. <laughs> Aww. I'm wearing this another comfy outfit. It's this comfy black set. I'm lucky I brought a couple options for my sister to wear because now I have a couple things to wear to wear cute clothes. We weren't really expecting to go out to dinner tonight, but we were like, he's a happy baby today. We're going to do that. And we're going to a place called Fish House. Let's do it. You got a grip phone now, man. <laughs> smack, smack. Hey guys, okay, a little bit of an update. We ended up deciding to just order in and we had a picnic literally right here just because we could tell Ty was starting to get tired and we're thinking, why do we need to go out? Even though it's like a restaurant literally in walking distance from here and I could just walk back if he got fussy. I thought, why do we not? Actually, Jay was like, why do we not just order the food, pick up and have it at home and do that? So we did that and that worked out perfectly. Ty is asleep right now and Jay is out watching some fight. This is where he went to college, obviously, so he, I think, met some friends out, and he's going to watch the fight, and I'm just hanging here, and I actually just ordered some dessert for us, and going to have that. It's, like, from some cinnamon roll place, so that's going to be really good, and just making a little night out of it. I was thinking, Jay and I were talking, we're like, wow, it's tiring watching a baby. We haven't even been doing it 24-7. Like, we literally, we literally were like Shelby and Josh, and actually every parent ever makes this look so easy. And I've been a nanny and a babysitter and all the things, and it used to wear me out then too. Like, I remember being so tired after I'd get done with like my shifts of babysitting or just like an all-day nanny, or sometimes it'd be overnight, and I'd be worn out. I really was, and I just give so much credit to parents especially I can't even imagine being a single parent and not having anyone relieve you or not having like a whole team behind you or multiple kids or anything because holy cow like it's a lot of work keeping humans alive and keeping them happy and fed and everything I'm like why are you crying can you just tell me I wish you could just tell me why you're crying but it's been like such a special time to spend this much time with him and also see my sister and my brother-in-law and Jay is like incredible I mean can Jay get any better I mean really though I said that to him Tyson I think was like the first newborn baby he had ever held and he looked so natural with him and now he's just like so so good with him and Ty loves him so much and I'm like you're perfect you literally are so good with kids so that has been good and it's fun seeing your boyfriend in a different light I guess because you like typically wouldn't see your significant other with babies that often I guess and yeah we leave tomorrow morning but it's gonna be a chill little night here and i'll show you guys when we get this dessert i think it's called like cinetastic or something i have no idea and sorry the lighting's kind of crazy because the tv is going but yeah that's just a little update for y'all and i'm gonna also pack my stuff up tonight so i don't have to worry about it in the morning to check out for our verbo airbnb and whatnot is at nine o'clock so we're gonna be kind of up and at them pretty early and then hit the road but everything's going really well here I totally forgot to show you guys. It's called Cineholic. Cinnamon roll with a bunch of fruit and frosting. It is so, so sweet, but it's so good. Oh my gosh. All right, y'all, we're back home in Tampa. I already went to the grocery store, got all of my stock, or all of my fridge stocked up. So I'm ready for the week. I'm glad I knocked that out now. And I am currently unpacking, doing some laundry and just trying to get my bearings straight before we have a busy week, but it feels so good to be home and I am just 
ready to relax once I finish all of this, jump in the shower, and I definitely need some rest so I can wake up feeling good because I'm still congested and ugh. Uh, but I think I'm gonna end off this vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed hanging out with me this weekend and I will see you guys in my next vlog. I love y'all, I adore y'all, and I'll see you guys next time.